more of our Origins Bonanza coverage. We're live at Origins 2017 with Hunter from Steve Jackson Games. And we're about to talk about the new Munchkin Shakespeare Deluxe. Yes, Munchkin Shakespeare Deluxe. This uh, was just recently kickstarted successfully and will be coming out to retailers later this year. This will be September-ish in that range and I have some copies at Gen Con. Uh, this is a new deluxe version. So it comes with the cardboard standees. It's got a board in it, of course. And uh, it's one of the biggest Munchkin projects we've done recently. Uh, we have this, we had an expansion that went along with it. Uh, and John worked overtime, but he got some really spectacular stuff. Uh, so it's, it's all Shakespeare themed, obviously. Uh, so you got a lot of, uh, there's already enough puns in Shakespeare that we could just kind of work with what they had, but it's got a lot of the original uh, classes and stuff like that from regular Munchkin, but we of course added the bard because you kind of have to. And uh, you get fun stuff like Henry the Eighth, <laughs> Henry the Fourth, Part One and Two are different monsters in the game. Uh, there are two bees, not two bees. Uh, you've got a lot of weapons, and of course you got some classic stuff like loaded die. Uh, so you have some th some of the same old thematic stuff from original Munchkin, wishing rings, things like that. Uh, but then in addition to that, you're going to have uh, a plague on both your houses and lots of it, lots of references to Shakespeare coming and coming in this set. So. A full size set uh, with a board and all the deluxe stuff, so it's a great it's a great starting point for people that are new to Munchkin, but it mixes in really well with original Munchkin as well. And uh, this is the first time you guys have kickstarted a Munchkin, correct? Yes, this is the first time we've done. We we kind of veterans to kickstart at this point with Ogre and uh, Dungeon Fantasy things like that, but this is the first time Munchkin's been there. Uh, it was a fan created project, so we wanted to take it to like a fan funding platform for it. It's a little bit different from what we've done in the past, but. Fans made it on uh, the Joko Cruise, I believe 2015 was when they designed oh, really? it. So, yeah, it was originally designed, it was a, they did a, uh, Steve and Andrew did a meeting with the uh, fans and were like, what would you guys like to make if you made a Munchkin set? And they pulled the audience and they were like, Shakespeare. So, okay, they made a bunch of Shakespeare cards. It was, it was about the size of a booster pack, like 15 or 30 cards. And since it's just grown and grown and gotten bigger and everyone liked it more. So uh, with the funding goals, we were able to make it a bigger game than it started out. It started out as a smaller, like th two to four player set and it became, went to a regular full size set. Then it went to a deluxe set and it has an expansion and there's bonus stuff for like dice coming out. We have a six pack of drama dice. We've got a demo pack that comes comes more, even more cards by guest artists and things like that. So tons of stuff coming out, and it'll a lot of the stuff is going to be hidden retail shelves as well. So if you missed out on the Kickstarter, you'll be able to get it at your local game store. And when's this coming out? Uh, this will be September. All right, September. Steve Jackson Games listening to the fan with Munchkin Shakespeare Deluxe. It looks like it might be a cup of tea. Be sure to check that one out later this year. If you're enjoying this Origins coverage, please be sure to click on the subscribe button down below. And as always, thanks for your time, YouTube.